Hiya! Yesterday I saw a crazy video from India. This video. It's a video of police hitting people for leaving their homes on the coronavirus lockdown. It gave me mixed feelings, to say the least. If I didn't do any research, I would just watch this video and say to myself What the hell is happening in India? When you look at the global news, you will see that most of what we hear about India's response to COVID-19 is negative. You will see that the second biggest nation of this world has a very bad coronavirus situation. But the numbers say something different. To my surprise, India, the big nation, has one of the lowest amount of COVID-19 cases per capita in the world. According to data, only 5 people out of 1 million have the coronavirus in India. In the US, that number is over 1,000. And in Italy, this number is over 2,000 people. That's why it is very important that we analyze why India could be doing better than other countries and not just focus on the negative news. India took the virus seriously before many other countries. They imposed the largest lockdown in the history of our planet. 1.3 billion people under a lockdown. That is an extreme measure. They did this very early when there were only 600 cases in the whole country and it paid off. It paid off with most of the people understanding how serious the virus is. It paid off with slowing down the spread. There's no one in the airport. Let's see what will I face. In comparison, the US was slow to impose any lockdowns and still does not have a national lockdown, despite being the number one in the world when it comes to the amount of cases. There is a lot many countries can learn from it. Learn that sometimes we need to take extreme measures in order to save lives. That's exactly what India is doing. Next on the list of why a 1.3 billion people nation has such a low amount of COVID-19 cases is rather unique. This is the BCG vaccine. Scientists believe that this vaccine helps fight the coronavirus. It's a vaccine which babies get to protect against tuberculosis. To my surprise, countries that require this at birth, like India or Japan, have many fewer cases than countries like the Netherlands or the US that do not require babies to get this vaccine. This is not fully confirmed yet, but many scientists see a very strong data behind it. And it gives us hope that sooner than later the world will see the actual vaccine for COVID-19. And as we hope for the real vaccine to be developed, let's also hope for more hot weather. Weather. Many people living in colder countries need to know this. The virus spread seems to be much slower in hot countries than in the cold ones. The statistics are very clear on that. But as far as the weather or the BCG vaccines are down to lack, severe travel restrictions, early airport screenings, and putting 1.3 billion people in a lockdown before many other smaller countries is what India deserves credit for. If you go on the internet, you will mostly see the negative news coming from India. The police hit civilians, the poverty, the crowded cities with no clean water, the mass prayers despite the lockdown, not enough tests, and the chaos. The chaos. It's true. India, just as most of the countries in this tough time, has a lot of issues. And this video is by no means to say that the current 8,000 cases in India can't become half a million like in the US. It's not to say that people are not suffering or that things are fully under control. But by choosing to focus only on the negatives, we will never get to learn from other countries, we will never get to progress, we will never believe that we can win against COVID-19. And in these tough times, when everyone is locked down, where people are dying and when the cases are growing day by day, the last thing we all need is doubt. Corona, corona, oh corona.